Hello, hello, Nusi, and good morning, all of you. How are you all? Fine, sir. Good morning, sir. Patricia, good morning. Um, Ayuk Baral. Yes, sir. Okay, will you please tell me your phone number or you write in chat, please? Why to tell in public? Write in chat. Okay. Oh, sir. <clears throat> Prison in chat box. I use GC. Prison in chat box. Ayuk Baral, I didn't get that. Ayuk? Ayuk Baral? Okay. Now it's already five minutes. Today, uh, we're going to read. Uh, after that, uh, graphical is already been completed. Today, we're going to read that solids. And uh, this is up to here, solid. The first term question has been asked. So this is the last chapter to learn for a second midterm. OK, today's date is 2000. 78 zero, 06 zero, 7 that is Thursday. Mm. Okay. 
and uh, uh, let's revise these uh, figures uh, which we learned in previous classes that how the figures are formed okay now if it is if it is a mobile box okay and mobile box is like this then if we cut it out if cut it from one part and make uh, like whole flat one how it becomes okay this front front part will be like this front part will be like this okay and this back part this south side down part will be upper side here and uh, the sideways how many four side sideways okay sideways this one part and this another part there will be four parts here or another part okay now one two three four bigger rectangular surface and uh, five six two the smaller square in the downside and upper side okay so this is how it becomes six faces see here this is, it is given here okay this first second these are cuboid and uh, do you know what is the third one this one third one what is this who can say what is the this third one cylinder yes that's great that becomes cylinder if uh, one cylinder that we cut it out of paper, then that becomes, okay, cylinder would be like this. And if we cut it out from one um, uh, part vertically, then uh, the inside, it becomes one rectangle and two circles, upper side and downside, okay? Two circles will be here. So next, and the fourth one, what is the fourth one? What is this? Cone. Cone. Yes, cone. that's great. Cone, yes. If a cone that it is like this, if cone is caught, it, caught out from one part, it becomes a circular, the part of circle, and upper side will be circle, okay? Now, I want to talk to Ro uh, Ramit Kumar Bania. Yes, sir. Okay, Ramit Kumar Bane, you write your phone number in chat box, please. Okay, sir. Now, Sandesh Nepali. Now, Rosa Parier. Rosa Parier. Ramit Kumar Bani, Ramit. Okay. Mm, thank you. And if you have just come, please present yourself in chat box. Now, uh, Ramit Kumar Banya, what may be this uh, fifth one? Ramit Kumar Banya, I'm talking to you. Sorgal. This one, fifth one, one, two, three, four, fifth. If we uh, fold it out, what became, becomes? Don't know? No, sir. Okay, uh, somebody please, uh, Sampada Pokhril. Yes, sir. Uh, will you guess what uh, that becomes? Triangle. Mm, okay, all are triangle, triangle, again folding, again becomes triangle. Okay, that's a nice guess anyway. Uh, uh, next, uh, Sonnan Swesta or who oh, want to uh, guess? Sir, Susan Kaur. Susan Kaur, you can guess. Okay. Sir, pyramid. Mm, pyramid. Okay. 
Yes. Triangle right. pyramids. Ah, uh, uh, you're right. Okay, and we call it uh, pyramid also, but special. It has got one another special name. If triangle is formed in this way, and okay, if uh, another triangle, three triangles. Okay, if you fold it out, mm. and okay, <laughs> this word it becomes, it becomes this. Okay, like diamond, it becomes like a diamond. And a special name for this is tetrahedron. And Sushant Kumar, what it told, that is also correct. And is there anybody taking part in math quiz from this section? Nobody? Hello? Sanan Shrestha, Sushant Kumar, Ayog Baral, Anish Sadiksha Thapa, Sadiksha Paudil. Nobody has taken? No, sir. Why? You didn't get uh, any information about math quiz? Sir, that also and another also is we are not interested. Another also means what? Sir, there are two reasons why we can't join. And first one is we don't know, and second oh. one is we we are not interested. <laughs> what uh, what is your answer? Why you are not interested? You you are so good in math, not interested is not fair. Sir, I was uh, I was in uh, English quiz, na, sir. Became keeper. Okay. Score keeper. Okay, fine, thank you. But uh, what about other person? Sir, I would like to join, sir. You like to take part. Yes, we didn't we didn't get information, sir. Oh no. Who is uh, okay? Who is math teacher? Sir, you. <laughs> okay, I think I didn't give you the information about that quiz. Okay, uh, there are there is selection uh, round already happening. I think. Okay, uh, who want to take part here? Just I want to. Uh, I'll write the name and I'll inform if you are interested. One is Susant Kumar, other? Other? Nobody? I, sir. Who? I, TC. Okay, good. Other? Okay. Uh, you two. Uh, uh, you, you just, uh, you know, in indiabix.com? No, sir. You don't know indiabix.com? Okay, I'm writing here. Okay, just uh, write this, uh, write this uh, site in the, you just prepare, go and prepare there uh, today. Uh, today will be uh, real sold down. You just uh, need to come, okay? India Bix, I N D I A B I X dot com. Okay, now this is becomes tetrahedron. Next, uh, the second last one. The second last one. What is this second Pyramid. last one? Prism. Pyramid. Prism. Uh, okay, that is prism. Okay, this becomes like this. Okay, that is a square in the middle. And if you fold and fold, it becomes like this. What shape it is? Pyramid. Okay, it is pyramid, yes. Yes. And the last one. Last one will be like this upper side also triangle, a downside also triangle, and here like this, and joining like this. Okay, it actually is do not become in that way. So it it is like this. Okay.
that shape becomes when you fold it, that becomes this one. What is that this shape? <laughs> this is triangular prism. This is triangular prism. Okay. Uh, thank you very much uh, for taking part here. And next, we are going to read about surface area and volume. What is surface area and what is volume? Okay. Now, Rosa Parriar. Rosa Parriar. She was here already left. Okay, at least Bosnet and others, please don't show your uh, ceiling, okay? From uh, Pramita, Pranit, Pratima Kumar, you're showing your ceiling. Better you show your work, okay? So, as somebody is showing, uh, Samjana Swesta, like that. Okay, uh, what are you showing? I don't know. This video is on. Nuga runs it. Nuga. Surface area. You know about surface area, Nuga? Do you know, uh, Nuga Ranjit, do you know about surface area? Okay, Nuga is not going to talk. This is angry with me, is it so? Darshan Thapa. Yes, sir. Do you know about uh, surface area and volume? No, sir. Okay, Ramit Kumar Baniya, Barsha fan. Please wear, uh, put on uh, our school dress. Okay. Yes. Tell me, tell me, please, that surface area and volume. What uh, What is surface area and volume? Don't know? No, sir. Okay, what do you see in the screen? Will you please read that one? From here. The surface area and volume of prism. Yes. Okay, sir. What what is a prism? How does how does its shape look like? Let's draw and present the figure of prism in the class. We have studied about the area and volume of cuboid and cubes in the previous class. In the chapter, we will learn we will learn about the total surface area cross cross sectional area lateral surface area and volume of different types of prism. Okay, thank you. Uh, uh, actually, uh, we are we're gonna read about the prism and we didn't know, we need to know what is prism. Okay, prism, uh, actually uh, this, uh, the box you are seeing this one, this is chalk box or uh, one, uh, okay, what kind of box? This is um, noodles cartoon, okay. Whatever you can think about this, this is also a prism. And prism actually means uh, it has got cross, cross sectional area, cross section. And what is cross section? Means uh, like, uh, okay, if I, I draw a picture of bread that you used to eat in dining hall, okay, this is bread. Okay, bread is also a prism. And how to know one figure is prism or not? Okay, if you want to know it is a prism or not, if you cut the bread and slice, make a slice of bread, again, that uh, upper side becomes again rectangle, same, isn't it? Okay, so uh, how to check that it's a prism or not? That means by cross section, that means cut surface. 
in easy language, you can tell cut surface. If you cut with a knife, then that surface becomes similar to the upper side or not. Since bread, if you slice bread, that becomes uh, very similar to every pieces. That is, it is also a prism. Okay, you got it? Excuse sir. Yes, please. Sir, it means uh, all the cubits are prism. Yes. Oh, that is the, what the greatest common sense, the important common sense you have got. Now, all uh, cuboid are prism. And other also, see, in other you can, uh, can you guess other uh, which are not cuboid, but they are prism? See this face. Uh, sorry. <laughs> see this. See this figure, second figure, B. This is L-shaped prism. Okay, how to draw that one? Uh, only artist uh, can draw this one like me. I am a greatest artist. I've already, I think I've already told you. I just got some more prizes in art in school level. Did you, did, do you believe? Or nobody believed that one? Anyway, if you believe also, if you don't believe also, I just made some Goff, giving Goffard, you know, some, sometimes Native Goffard is making some time to make fun. Okay, this is how we draw this L-shaped prism. Now, can you tell me how it became prism? Can you tell me? Can you guess somebody, please? Rosa Perrier, I was, actually, I wanted to talk today who uh, are very less have talked to me. Okay, yes, somebody please tell me, but... Here, who are less talking, Elise Bosnet, Anu Shrestha, Anushka Khadka, they have talked only once with me, Bipasa Karki. Okay. Uh, they, uh, Nuga Ranjit. Nuga Ranjit? Okay, not talking. See, this is the thing that uh, the student will not uh, responding, will not respond. Okay. Now, uh, now, who, who was responding there? How it be, how it is a how it is a uh, prism? Sir, if we cut it, then also it will form cuboid. No, when you cut it, the every piece surface must be same. This, if you cut it, then that uh, what shape it comes when you when you cut. L-shape. Yes, that is L-shape. See, now, uh, whenever you cord, uh, you have to think from where to cord, okay? If you cord from here, if you cord from here, then actually it doesn't become same shape. Up to here, it is same shape, but from here, it will be different shape, okay? The bigger you will get. So, if you cord from this uh, side with knife, then you think that, oh, this will not be the um prism but if you cord from here if you cord in this way okay if you cord in this way with knife then again it becomes l l shape the surface become l okay so it is it is called l shaped prism again if you cord next pieces here again it becomes l shaped okay with knife okay so it is l shaped prism so why we are talking about your prism is if it is a prism, it is easier to find surface area and volume. So then we got to uh, do this one. We got to do this one here that how to make uh, the, how to, um, uh, what do you call it? Summarize or generalize the formula to find that uh, surface area of prism. Okay, let's do from here. Uh, let's talk about let's talk about the volume. Okay, what is the volume of this cube? If it is length is L, breadth is B, and height is S, what is the volume of this cuboid? L into B into H. Yes. L 
into B into S. Okay, from here, the generalization is L into B means the base area. Okay, L into B is base area into height. And for base area, now in prism, for base area, we call cross section area. into height. Okay, this is how we do that one. For example, here, if you have to find the volume of this L-shaped prism, okay, have you ever seen L-shaped uh, uh, bread? Nobody? Have you seen like this bread? Bhumika, have you seen this kind of bread in uh, uh, bakery? Bakery? No, sir. Okay, actually you have to do a special order in your birthday, okay? l shaped cake, being a mathematics lover. Okay, there's something you have to do. Okay, I'm mathematics lover. You, you're going, going the bakery and saying, my birthday is coming, I'm mathematics lover. So please make like this prism type L say prism cake, please. You can why is circular always? You know, I have to, and after going my home, I have to find the volume and area, whatever. So I told him like this. You can go in this way so that you will be attached with mathematics. Okay, now uh, this is also prism, and this is cross section means uh, from where we caught it comes same shape surface that is cross section that is L. Now for this volume, we need to do. Oh, what we have to do is <clears throat> the cross section area into height, uh, volume. That means if it is okay, first of all, you need to have some uh, information. This is maybe 10, um, this may be uh, six, height may be, uh, sorry, this upper side, this may be six, and this may be uh, five. And uh, cross section area after this, I think you can find it. And this, this may be four. Okay, now, how can we find the volume? First of all, for this, we have to find the area of cross section. This is one of the important part here. Area of cross section. Okay, now to find the area of cross section, you have to, uh, you need to do a little bit uh, work harder here. Uh, that means or harder means work differently in drop side. Uh, just I want to suggest to you if you have got brilliant mind that you can without do this we can do this you can do this. First of all, you just draw L shaped in drop side so that it will be easier. How to find and you think how can we find the uh, area of this part? That means this side is ten uh, and this side is uh, four and this side is six. Uh, and uh, this side is also four. Okay, now I actually here need to be one information here also four. Okay, that's just guessing, okay? Now, if this information are given, I want to know from the mathematics brilliant and all of you that how can you find this uh, area of this shape? Who can tell, please? How can you find this area of this shape? Is there anybody genius to find, to guess? Afsana Subedi, don't block that camera, please. Ranjan Gaire, Swamik Tulachan. Okay, I'm taking the name. Sandesh. Okay, Sandesh Nepali, you're here. Simon Khadka, Prasanna Dawadi, you're coming. Hello, Sandesh Nepali. Hello, Sandesh. Hello, Sandes. Mm -hmm. Okay, no, no more. Okay, nobody's guessing, so I'm talking here. First of all, you have to draw one line here. And now it becomes two part here, one and two part. And 
Pratima Kumar, oh, how to find the EF this lower part? You know? Yes, sir. How to find that lower part? Don't know? Okay, see the WhatsApp, uh, Pratima Kumar. WhatsApp it is, see? WhatsApp it is. LCP, no, no, this one. This one only. This one only, the second part. WhatsApp it is. Rectangle. Rectangle. Then what is the formula to find the rectangle's area? L into B. Yes, that is L into B. You know it, but you are not, you don't, are not telling L into B. Then what is L? Um, 10. 10. And what is B? 4. 4. Then what is 10 into 4? 40. 40. That's great. Again, uh, another shape one. For area of shape one, rectangle one, what is the area again that is also rectangle L into B? What is L? Mm. Sorry? What is L? Pratima? I guess six. Okay, why it is six? See, up to your hole is six. But what about this much only? Ten. How ten? Okay, how ten? Okay, now uh, show him to baby. Thank you, Pratima. Yes, sir. How? How 10 she is selling? Sir? How much is that? L into B equal to shape one. So six into four. Uh, how six into four? The uh, shape one is only this much. Six is for hold this one. Sir, shape one is square. Uh, four. Okay. Now uh, you need to know, see, for shape one, you need to know what is length and what is breadth. Okay, this is one of the tasks which you have to think uh, mathematically here. Uh, who knows? Uh, otherwise, I, I'm going to tell. Say me, I. Yes, please. Yeah. But it will be three because six will divide it into two, uh, two parts. So. Okay, thank you. That's the same thing. It will be two because up to here is. Okay, this is four, isn't it? This is four. Yes, that means this also will be four. But upper side is six means there must be two. And what about this? This is length is two. The what is the breadth? So six. Yes, six because whole is 10 up to here it is four that there must be six so it, it will be like six into two that would be like 12. okay now uh, uh okay this is centimeter let's say this is centimeter so uh, the l shaped area will be equals to sum of this first and second shape so you can just write here the area of cross section equals to uh, first rectangle area of area of first rectangle plus area of second rectangle. That will be because the first rectangle will be equals to. 10 into 4 plus second rectangle will be equal to 6 into 2. Okay, that will be equal to 40 plus 12. And uh, another person, the Wadi and Rosa Pariyar and Sandesh Nepali, you are coming, person, the Wadi actually coming regularly, but never have talked to me. And other not coming, not actually responding. Okay, Sandesh Nepali, I took your name, but you are already out. It's not fair. Okay, this is. 52 centimeters square. So 
cross section first part is finished now volume for volume that will be equals to cross section area into height area into height see here what is cross section area uh, is already there what is height can you guess which is height here which is height someone swesta guess which is height in this figure sir height yes sir i think 6 okay you think 6 okay pros on the body what is height i am talking and asking you for so many times but not talking again when i talk to you wherever you go i don't know pros on the body i can see your uh, this pros on the body Yes, sir. What is height in this figure? Okay. Uh, if you don't know, just tell. Six. Don't. Okay, six. Okay, I'll tell you. So you answer one thing. Okay, only. La. At last, you. I. I got one tick for you. Okay, at least one answer wrong. Wrong. Maybe wrong. Maybe right. That doesn't matter. But you answered. Now, uh, next, uh, Vidya Pokhrel. Guess one. Guess please. Okay. See, Vidya Pokhrel not responding. Is very nice. Okay. Actually, this six is not height in. Um, Now prism, let's say prism in the in this kind of prism, the height will be this one. Okay, you just need to think that this is the base. Okay, this cross section is the base. If you place uh, this cuboid, just turning in that way, making that base, this five becomes height. So height will be that five. Okay, this six is the uh, breadth of that L shape. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, this is the end of our class. and you just write present in chat box we are from 45 we are uh, 40% here in the uh, up to last minute so thank you for being here up to the last minute and being here now it is 52 multiply by the height 5 then that will be the centimeter cube will be the volume okay after multiplication okay thank you very much tomorrow we will continue this and as today i have posted uh the material and uh, linear equation assignment uh, linear equation assignment so hopefully you are doing that in a copy today is the submission day uh, time limitation so hope you'll do that one in time okay okay bhumika chetri you did write present in chat box i think no no sir okay please it's uh, less than 1 minute remaining Prasant Burathoki, don't forget because Prasant and uh, Prasant Burathoki and Prasant Dawari, I have to remember those names because their attendance will not be in DN, though they are present.